Hi, my name is Chris, and this is a short video about Wellwatch, a website for folks who are dealing with natural gas extraction in their community. Wellwatch is a project by the Extract Group at MIT. So to find Wellwatch, you can just go ahead and type Wellwatch MIT into Google, and it should be the first thing that comes up. At the center of Wellwatch is a map. Here you can type in an address, a town name, so I'm just going to go ahead and type Silt, Colorado. In Silt, you can see there's a bunch of drills near Silt, right by the airport. And if we click on one of those drills, you'll see that up comes an API number. Every well in the country has an API number. Uh, it starts with the state number, the county number, and then the actual number for the facility itself. So I'm just going to go ahead and click on that. And you'll see that there's a well there's a page on the wiki for every single well in the country. Um, so this is API number whatever. And you can zoom in on the map and you can see actually there's a bunch of well heads on that one pad. Uh, you can see that it's operated by Encana Oil and Gas. Um, and you can see the latitude and longitude. Uh, those are the GPS numbers. Um, you can see the well name. Uh, and you can see over here uh, that there's some information about uh, who takes care of wells in Colorado at the bottom of the page. And you can see that there's a space over here also for notes and complaints. Um, so I can go ahead and make a note about that. Um, and I'm going to say um, airport wells. You can see these wells. when you land at the Rifle Airport. And if I happen to have a picture of it, I can upload it. Um, I don't have a picture of this, so I'll just go ahead and save it. And there's the complaint. So I can go back to that uh, page for the, for the well there by the airport in Silt. You can see now that my note is coming up on that page. So anyone who has anything to say about that well can add it, and that note will show up on that well or facility. I can also come up with a complaint so let's say that uh, in this case my pump jack, jack is leaking and it's a problem with the facility uh, and it's affected my soil. Um, I can come up with a start date and an end date and I can say if it's a recurring problem, if the problem's still going on. And I'm going to say that this is um, Jim Mule Energy is the name of the company that runs this. And was there a particular employee? Well, Jim Yule was the guy who drilled the well, so um, I'll say that's a problem. And I'll just say that the pump jack is leaking water and smells like gasoline. And do I have a photo? I might have a photo. I'll go ahead and I'll choose a file. Um, say that there's the drip. There's a photo of the drip. Also, I want to mention on the left-hand side over here, there's a help section, and there uh, we've got a little bit of information about help. I've got an oil and gas issue, um, help with the wiki engine, media wiki en engine that we're using, um, and help for the Wellwatch site itself. Uh, as you can tell, we're still building this section out. Um, and we also want to mention that if you look up here on the main page, there's a section for a status update, and this shows, uh, we'll, we'll try to keep this updated with information on how we're doing. Uh, notice that we've uploaded about 92,000 facilities for Colorado, uh, about 307,000 for Texas, uh, 37,000 for New York, and for the other states, um, uh, we have the well information, but we don't yet have pages um, uh, for, I'm just going to go to Youngstown, Ohio here. Um, so we have, uh, uh, we are scraping the database from the state, and we do have the map set up so you can at least explore but we don't yet have the ability to complain or have an individual page on the website for each of the um, wells yet. Um, but we're hoping to do that soon, so uh, stay tuned to the site. Um, uh, we're really interested in uh, getting feedback from you. Uh, if you go ahead and, and create an account, um, it'll let us communicate more directly with you. Uh, you don't have to put in your real name, you can if you want, but uh, you'll get a username and then we're going to be able to leave you messages if you've got a question or something like that. So. Um, please come on over to Wellwatch, uh, use it, let us know there's a problem, extract at media.mit.edu, or you can find it down at the bottom of the page there. 
Um, so let us know, uh, and we're very, very interested in hearing from you. Thanks. And in the complaint page, you'll see uh, that it also asks for a headline. So now this well isn't leaking, but if it were, if it were a well on my property, I could say that it's leaking. Um, this is a problem with the uh, facility itself. Um, and uh, let's see, what's being impacted? Well, my ground, uh, my soil is being affected by the leak. And let's see, that started last week. So I'll just put it in there. Uh, and uh, let's see, it, it's still going on, so I'll just put in today's date. Is this a recurring complaint? Well, yeah, it's still leaking. Um, and Canna was the operator of the well. Um, and were there specific employees? No. Detailed complaint explanation. There's a leak from the pump jack. Uh, to be water. If I have a picture, I can show that. Um, oh, crap. So in addition to leaving notes for, uh, you know, general information and for positive things, you can also leave a complaint.